0345 973. Uh, let's go back to your calls and comments. This is on the, well, is there a gravitational pull to right-wing politics in this country? One survey seems to suggest so. Abbas is in Redbridge. What are your thoughts? Hi there. Just a comment that uh, Mr. Gerard Batten made about uh, Islam being a death cult and the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, being a paedophile. He said it was a matter of fact. Uh, it's not a matter of fact. It's his opinion. Uh, the, the, the fact that people raise the issue about the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, marrying Aisha under the age of 16 and saying, therefore, that's paedophilia, you cannot apply the uh, social consensus which is how morality is governed within a secular society of the 20th or the 21st century and apply it retrospectively in the 7th century and then call it paedophilia. I, th- I thought that the, whole, the whole point about the teachings of Islam was that it, it was the one religion that didn't change. It didn't alter its core beliefs and systems to appease the age. It doesn't, but the reality here is this. There are lots of caveats in terms of marrying uh, a young woman. So, for example, the social consensus of that time, the, uh, the, 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 the governing law in terms of uh, marriage in Islam, and Judaism, in fact, is puberty. Puberty becomes the age at which you may consummate the marriage. Now, that does not mean to say that is when you should marry, okay. but that is the minimum that has been set. So your, your so contention within, is that Gerard Batten, all right, Gerard Batten should have made a distinction between his opinion, which you, you don't have any truck with, even though you disagree with it, but you believe he's entitled to it, and what he called fact. Exactly. I, I talk to lots of people and they say to me, oh, this is paedophilia. When I explain to them that within a secular society, morality is governed by social consensus, it's the social consensus, for example, even in the 21st century today. OK, on that point, Abbas, we hit the clock, but thank you. Uh-